This is Rachel Kaiser with runningjews.com. I'm here at Summer OR 2014 with Golden from Ultra Footwear. What shoe do you have for us today? Uh, today we're talking about the uh, One Squared, and this is our uh, performance training model. So along the lines of something like a Saucony Kinvara uh, or other performance trainer. Cool thing with this shoe is it's got a little bit more cush up front than a standard performance trainer, and yet it's an uh, extremely lightweight shoe, so a little bit lighter than what people are used to at the same time. So you get a ton of cush and not very much weight. We think, as far as we know, it has the uh, biggest uh, cushion to weight ratio shoe or of any shoe on the market. So super cushy, responsive at the same time, but lightweight shoe. Uh, it's very flexible, it has inner flex in it, so we've cut grooves into the midsole from the top, uh, both directions, almost like a ten tennis racket. That makes the shoe just extremely flexible, so you can get a really fast toe off out of the shoe, and it's gonna be really natural. Like all ultra shoes, it is zero drop, but uh, well cushioned, and uh, so that's gonna help your running technique, uh, help you hold form late in a race. That was kind of the key thing with a shoe like this, is you know mile 21 of a marathon, when you start to break down, uh, you want a shoe that keeps you from breaking down, helps you maintain good technique and be able to finish strong. So uh, that's gonna help with this. And then of course, our uh, foot-shaped toe box, as usual. Um, which is perfect for um, you know racing a marathon or any kind of long runs because your feet are going to be able to relax, spread out. You're going to get more power transfer. That big toe is going to be able to kick out and hammer off the ground harder, and it's, it also stabilizes your foot too. So um, that is the one squared, and we're we're super proud of it. Very light, very flexible, super comfortable, and uh, that's it. And I know Zero Drop is a signature for Ultra. Um, what is your all's philosophy behind having a Zero Drop platform in all of your models? You know, it's pretty simple. Um, people are born Zero Drop. You come that way, you get out of bed every morning that way. And so um, we're trying to not alter what the body does. Adding any heel lift to the shoe causes the landing point to shift forward, which causes more impact. And so uh, we're just trying to get out of the way and let your body do its thing. Uh, if you film people in regular shoes versus zero drop shoes, you'll see that people land with much higher impact, a much straighter knee in a traditional shoe. Um, the excess weight in the heel causes the foot to dorsiflex more, um, and then the excess height of the heel causes people to land earlier. And so we think those are not great things. You know, we want people to run as they were intended to run. And you know, if people uh, have some sort of um, issue where they feel like they need drop, it's really easy to add you know, a heel lift to the shoe. It's really hard to take it out once it's already built in there. So it um, makes sense to, to us and I hope to a lot of the other people too. Well, thank you so much, Golden. And this has been Rachel with runningshoes.com.